Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Sarah OJ. If you haven't noticed already, it's a try and haul, but it's a swimwear try and haul. And this is from Pretty Little Thing. I think I need a vacation or a holiday because, yes, this swimsuit is giving me life. Like, I picked up six pieces. This is my favorite piece. Out of the six pieces that I bought, this is the favorite one. And. Just a love fit. Oh, a little disclaimer, guys. I am wearing some underwear underneath all of these pieces. I know they put a the little hygienic strip there, but wasn't very comfortable with it because I don't feel like they're that adhesive. I feel like they do peel off and I'm just not doing all that. This has restored all levels of confidence for me personally. I feel like this is the best suited swimsuit for my body. Uh, like I'm feeling it. Like, so I don't want to show y'all too much, but you get the drift. This two-piece was, um, it's not even a two-piece, they're actually sold as separate, but it's the plus orange leopard print high-rise bikini. And I've got the bottom in a size 20, and I've got the top in a size 18. So the bottoms, a ten pounds and the top is ten pounds. But I've got a fupa, I've got a mummy tummy, so you'll see in the other swimsuits like it shows a bit more, but I like this because it kind of like holds me in in the right places, but it's still giving um the sexy vibes. And obviously it's a boob tube, you know what a boob tube do. You know, I think it gives me the support I need, to be honest. I just, I'm in love with it. I really like it. Yeah, this is sexy. This is sexy. This is really, really sexy. Like, I'm giving them Flintstone vibes. Giving them Wilma. Giving them, just, I'm just, yeah, nah, this is sexy. If you say otherwise, you're hating. This is sexy, but that's just my opinion. Nah, man, nah, I really feel confident in this. And I'm not a swimsuit kind of girl, like, oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. So next up is this baby. This is a plus monochrome, two-tone tie waist swimsuit. Yeah, I got this in a size 20, and it was 20 pounds. <sighs> I like the concept, don't get me wrong, but I feel like I just have too much um, fupa to pull this off. I feel like I have too much spillage. And I got a size 20. The size I picked was pretty generous, to be honest. Like, I don't feel like if I got any bigger, it would have made a difference because the sleeves aren't even staying up. So it might even be too big for my upper body. But it's just, I don't know. I, I feel like I'm just falling out of it. Like, I don't feel comfortable in it. And the, the way this thing is giving me the dirtiest wedgie, yeah, it's very disrespectful. It's violating me. I mean, obviously, I love the concept, the whole monochrome thing. It is nice, but I think I just got too much fupa for this kind of style. And I noticed that with a lot of their swimsuits, because they're doing this whole high cut thing, which is nice. I think it's sexy, but I feel like it's better suited when you have less of a tongue. I get what they tried to do. I just don't feel comfortable in it. I don't feel I don't feel comfortable in it. I don't feel comfortable in it. I don't feel like I'm getting the support I need in the bust area. I don't feel like I'm getting support in it, period. I mean my waist looks snatched in it, but everything else is just literally falling out. So the next up is this lady. Oh, guys. I'm not even upset with Pretty Little Thing yet. It's just different things suit different bodies better. But I do have an issue with the lack of support. Being that it's for plus size girls, typically we do have a bit more boobage. And for all these plunge designs, I feel like there has to be something that can support the bust. I mean, like, if it's something to adjust the straps with, or do you know just something to hold the girls up? Because my boobs ain't sitting, honey. They're just not. And I'm not gonna wear a bra with this. It's swimwear. 
but you know and here they go again with this high thigh cut thing like i know that's on trend that's the th that's the thing now that's the lick that's what people's doing but yeah. so this is a plus white slinky wrap detail swimsuit this was in a size 20 well this is in a size 20 and it's 20 pounds again I mean, god damn it, what's a girl gotta do to get some support around here? Like there's just too many things wrong. There's just too many things not where they where they should be and where I would like them. I get the concept. I get it. It's sexy if I had less boobs. It would be sexier if I had less tummy. I just need more support. I just need more of this. You get me? Not this. I just need more of this. And this high high thigh thing, yeah, it's all good. But if I didn't have these these knickers on, you would basically see my vagina. You would basically see that. And that's a bit crude, I think. But <laughs> to each his own, who am I to judge? So let's talk about this. <laughs> this one's sexy. This is a plus orange halter neck back to the swim suit. This is in a size 20 and it is 18 pounds. Right. What's wrong with my camera? Right. They got it right with this one, yeah? The fact that it has the halter neck thing, so it's a tie back, that gives you the support that you wouldn't get in another swimsuit, yeah? And this high thigh thing that they've been doing, I feel like it was cut at the right height. Because even though there's still a bit of food pond, still a bit of like spillage, it's sexy with it. Like, you know, this is this is cute. I mean, yeah, like you can adjust it to whatever. But I like this one. I'm happy with this one. This one is sexy. She is sexy. I feel fierce. If it was red, I'd be giving them Baywatch facts. But, you know, this is for the neon, the neon lovers. You know, this is on trend right now. I do have another neon swimsuit to show y'all, but that one was a bit of a... I feel comfortable in this. With a nice cover-up, some nice heels, some nice sunglasses. Like, I feel comfortable in this. And I feel sexy too, so... So next up is this plus pink tropical. Where the, why is it pink? Okay, yeah, it's got a bit of pink, pink in it, but it's mostly green. But it's a plus pink tropical print wrap detail swimsuit. I got this in a size 20 and it was 20 pounds. There's not much to say about it really. Like I like the print, I like the style of it, but some adjustments could be made. I.e. that, maybe bring that cut just a tad lower, but that's just for me. For a, a next girl, it'll work, but... I mean, the price points aren't bad, but it's just the, it's just the, you know, the overall fit of it. I don't feel comfortable in it. I don't feel sexy in it. I feel exposed. I feel like, mm, okay, this could have been adjusted. Last but not least is this plus neon green plunge pleat swimsuit. Yeah, I got this in a size 20. And this was 18 pounds. So my thoughts, my thoughts. I loved the design of it. When I saw it on the model, I was like, mm. my whole issue is the whole support thing. I need the support in the booby area. <sighs> and maybe this swimsuit is a bit too big for me, you know, because there's so much space. I've got no support from these straps at all none whatsoever so you can't even see like the beauty of it you'd have to check what the model's wearing and be like okay it looks similar but it's not the same it's just the lack of support in the booby area but i like it for the trend's sake and the whole neon neon thing i like it i like that the high cut thing is not too up my vagina and it's still kind of modest you know, it it has the potential, it just needs a bit more support in this area. So I made it tighter, 
But yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, I feel like maybe that should be a thing that plus size swimwear adds to their swimsuits. Adjustable straps for the girls, like at the back, it can be concealed, it cannot be so obvious. But adjustable straps, especially for these type of designs, where it's very plungy, all of that kind of stuff, just a bit more support. But this is really nice, oh, snatchy. I love the way it makes my waist feel. I do feel nice from here downwards. <sighs> but yeah, that's, that is the last out of the six. So I tried on six and I'm going to change back into my most favorite one and then round up this video. And that's basically what I wanted to say. Yes, yeah, so I'm back with my favourite one. Do you know what I'm realising? I think two pieces suit me better than one pieces. That's how I feel. I feel like anything that just puts my whole body in it doesn't really complement my figure. But anything that kind of like is separated, I feel like it just complements my figure better. So, <sighs> this swimsuit is just so goals, man. Are you crazy? Are you crazy? No, I haven't felt this sexy in a swimsuit ever, even when I was slimmer. Like, this makes me just want to fly away today for one day because I only got one swimsuit. But hey, oh, the bars again. You don't think it's a joke? You don't think it's a joke? I was a rapper in my past life. I'm like convinced now. I'm convinced. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm going to link everything down in the description box. And if you would like to, could you let me know what you want me to try on next? Do you want me to do more swimwear? Do you have any brands that you'd like me to try out? Yeah. Because I'm coming to represent the plus size girls hard this year. I'm not holding back. I'm not hiding. You don't have to take me through and all. I ain't going nowhere. I just got started, bitch. But pretty little thing, you're doing good in terms of design and keep making the plus size girls feel included. We feel sexy too, don't get it twisted. I just feel like a few adjustments need to be made for the straps. Um, but other than that, you're all doing a good job. Keep it up. And if you ever need a model, <laughs> don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Give me a thumbs up. If you like this video, don't forget to leave some comments down below. Tell me what you liked about this video. Look at me. 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 I look so sexy. Hey, I look so sexy. Hey.